Hi everyone, my name is Luke Fidel, and I'm a fight director and a super at the Houston Grand Opera. That means whenever you see some sort of violence that's happening on the stage, I'm usually involved in it in some way, shape, or form. Most likely, I'm getting beat up by one of the principals. I love my job. Anyways, we're here to make light of a dark situation and sort of talk about what we've been doing while we've all been locked away. I have been organizing my entire house. That includes my HGO show shirts. Now, the company office, who take care of us, and we love them, they take care of us by giving us a free show shirt with each opening night. And so I've saved all my shirts, and I'm going to go through each one in like a chronological order, maybe talk a little bit about the show. So here we go. First show I'm going to talk about is Aida. This is Aida we did a while back. It was the Zandra Rhodes production. It was my second opera, so it was still very green. But as you can see, this show is very bright and turquoisey. Uh, the next show uh, is The Passenger. This show is amazing because it, it gave us the opportunity to travel up to New York and perform at the Park Avenue Armory. I never got to perform on a New York City stage before, and this gave me the opportunity to do that. So I'm very, I treasured this shirt a lot. Uh, four, this, this next shirt is the start of the four-year journey into the ring cycle. So this was Rheingold. Uh, the next show is Otello. In this show, I got beat up. You know, this is one of those shows where you can see me get beat up by Michael Cassio. He was a tenor. He, he threw me around a little bit and roughed me up. Next show, you didn't see me at all, but you might remember me. I was the bear in Magic Flute, so that was fun. Uh, the second uh, part of the ring cycle, Die Valkyrie. As you can see, this shirt has some wear and tear because it's one of my favorite shirts I wear a lot. Uh, the next show is Eugene Wanyagen, the show with all the chairs. Uh, Rosalka was a fun show, The Modern Day Little Mermaid. We were all Jezzy Babas, and we helped her conduct her spells when we did that show. Uh, Siegfried was the third show in the ring cycle. Uh, this is the dragon that we had to fight. Uh, we were part of the dragon, the giant mobile that we were part of. Uh, Faust, I played God. played God in Faust, and I also was a fight director on this show, so we did all the fight choreography for that show. That was fun. Uh, the final show of the ring cycle was Goddard Damaru. I was uh, a crane operator again, but I was also Loki at the very end. I got to travel around on a little segue. Uh, the next year we were at uh, Resilient Theater at, at the George R. Brown, so we didn't really get any t-shirts. But we came back strong the next year with the Flying Dutchman, and we were all ghost pirates. Uh, then La Bohem uh, was going on at the same time, so we were doing that show as well. Uh, we came back with another Zandra Rhodes production, uh, The Pearl Fisher. So it was also another bright, very turquoisey show. Uh, this year we started out with Rigoletto, you know, the one with the ladder. I was one of the guys who climbed the ladder in that show, so you might have saw me. And then finally, we uh, this is the last shirt I got so far. It was just sort of the season shirt for this season. Uh, I was the flight director for La Favorite, and I was also uh, in Aida. So uh, that's all, I, all the shirts I have. Uh, make sure thank you guys for tuning in and listening to me. Remember, wash your hands, keep, stay safe, stay indoors. We'll all get through this. Don't worry. Have fun. See, see you guys later.